I'd buy that for a dollar. No. <laughs> you got a few things going on. We're going to kick it off with a little Tomb Raider style because boobage is always boobage, everybody. But we're not getting that because we're getting Sophie Turner from Game of Thrones. She was Sansa through basically eight seasons of the show. And while I like her as an actress and I liked her as Sansa, she adopted her, the dire wolf that she had on the show, she adopted it in real life. So the dog that played her dire wolf actually is her actual dog. So I got total respect for that total pet person mm -hmm. over here. We got a German Shepherd dog. We got some cats, we got some chickens outside now. So everything is totally cool in that regard. But you know, Aragorn adopted his horse. Yeah, he did. Well, yeah, that too. I love seeing that from actors. Like, hey, you actually give a shit. You actually got attached. Hey, that's awesome. You know, Keanu and his dogs, you know, it, it all flows the same. I, I was and... going to say, how many dogs does Keanu got? What's that? I was going to say, how many dogs does Keanu got? Like, oh. dogs are like his pleasure. I think he's got like three or four. I could be wrong about that. Miz has like nine. <laughs> He's also got a kid or two as well, but he also has Maurice. Oh, well, Maurice is the one that's got the fucking ranch of dogs. He just, yeah. <laughs> and she's also got Mrs. Balls in her purse, so that's how that works. Well, speaking of balls and purses, this is what we're getting for the Laura Croft TV show on Amazon Prime. And what is shaping up to be one of the hottest TV casting searches this fall? Amazon MGM Studios has assembled a wish list of a wish list of accomplished young actors for the role of Lara Croft in Tomb Raider, Prime Video's high-profile series adaptation of the video game franchise from Emmy-winning Fleabag creator Phoebe Waller-Bridge. Fuck off, Phoebe. <laughs> You've uh, ruined enough franchises, Phoebe. You're about to ruin uh, Tomb Raider as well, which is already tanking as it is. But, you know, basically it looks like it's between Sophie Turner and Lucy Boynton uh, as they're testing for the parts for, for basically Laura Croft in the TV show. I do not know if this show is really going to get made. I don't, I don't know what's going on over there. Because Kevin's trying to break his studio and not actually be part of the stream anymore. Kevin, the glory hole's in the back wall. Um, <laughs> somebody's knocking. They got a 20 for you, buddy. But uh, now, Chad, are you a fan of Tomb Raider? What do you kind of think of some of this? Oh, or Did you man. check out Game of Thrones? You got any idea? She doesn't even fucking look the part. Even if you no, dye her hair, she, she doesn't look it to me. She she doesn't. I mean, I saw the the Tomb Raider movies with um, Angelina Jolie, and some of that was mainly because I like you know Chris Berry from when he was on Red Dwarf. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, but I I don't know. This just I don't have a whole lot of faith in Amazon to begin with. Yeah. This just does not. This doesn't excite me, you know. Yeah, I'm not too. I, I I'm not. I'm just not a fan of this casting choice. Like, no. if they really do go, with, now I, to be fully clear, I do not know who Lucy Boynton is. I have not seen Bohemian Rhapsody. Have either of you seen that one? No. No. All right then. Then yeah, I can't really. I love Queen enough not to see it. Yeah. So. Well, I thought it was going to be Haley Atwell. That would have been good. Be. But that like, I would make that a goddamn movie at this rate. I wouldn't yeah. do a goddamn TV show with her. Like, Haley Atwell is yeah. more for Hollywood and feature films than fucking TV, even though I love the Agent Carter show for two seasons. Yeah. Uh, she's probably also contracted with me, too. Yeah. Probably. You know how they're with, down with that. We don't like long-term contracts, but we do want to own you. Are you down with that? We down with OPP. Hmm. Well, so is Amazon Prime because, you know, we're trying <laughs> to get a RoboCop show going. They're reimagining Voltron with Henry Cavill. Uh -huh. uh -uh. Not, not, yeah, and what I've, so. been reading on, what I've been reading on the Voltron thing is they're going to be doing a whole new cast of characters. They're not going to go with the oh! from the old show. Oh, 
Yeah. What's the? Uh, yeah, exactly. Yep. So I'm. I read that and I'm like, okay, I'm out. Yeah. I mean, I'll still watch the goddamn thing, but I'm already like, yo, again, like, come on, get off this shit. Netflix I had a forgive, better Voltron. I can forgive some changes that the that Amazon makes, I but golly, do they make enough changes to IPs where you just kind of like, it, it's starting to not feel familiar anymore. Yeah. Well, they had but, a chance at a Conan TV show, and they told Ryan Connell to go fuck himself. Canceled it because it was too gritty, too, what? too badass. What is he going to do? He goes off and does House of the Fucking Dragon, which is a killer show. Season two kind of ended a little wonky, but I still really liked it. I'd rather see Conan fucking wrestle giant dragons and beasts and, and slice and, off uh, serpent gods of some sort. Yep. You know? Word. I don't know. I had to take my wife to the hospital uh, about two weeks ago. And she was miserable, of course. We were in the waiting room for the ER. And Conan was on in the ER. <laughs> in the ER. <laughs> and I'm like, fuck you! <laughs> Sorry, babe. You go take care of yourself. I'm going to be right here for the next couple of hours. <laughs> And she's like, uh, "What is this?" I'm like, "Baby, it's Conan. It's Conan." And it was the part where stay hurt, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it was, it was the part where he cuts his mom's head off and shit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, and she's like, "Fuck me!" Like her day just got worse. <laughs> <laughs> my God, my husband's trying to kill me. And she won't watch it. I'm like, Conan is so much better than what you. It's a great movie. Not the second one, but the first one's fucking rad. Goddamn right. The second well, one's cool. Planning to cover Just those not as rad as the first one. Next year. So. <sighs> Lara Croft. Though. Nope. Not doing it. Nope. Thank you for watching this clip from our Dead Wire live streams every Saturday night at 9 p.m. Pacific time. Did you like this clip? If so, please make sure you hit that like button, share, and subscribe to this video. Stay tuned to all of our video content. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next time.